Hi, uh, my name is Ankita Chaudhary. Uh, I am a first year student at the Edler full time MBA program. I'll graduate in May 2018. So, doing your MBA? Uh, uh, yep. Uh, uh. I'm concentrating in MIS and I'm also planning to pursue a dual degree. I chose Eller because uh, I always wanted to concentrate in MIS and uh, as everyone knows Eller is one of the best programs for MIS, it's the top ranked program in the US. Also uh, uh, Eller allows you, uh, the MBA program is flexible enough, it's a small uh, cohort and it allows you uh, to customize your concentration, uh, you have an uh, option to select multiple electives from uh, various concentrations. Uh, I've close to five years of work experience. I was working with Capgemini. Uh, I've uh, worked in different roles. I have worked in the pre-sales department. I've worked as an application developer. Okay, so where did you do your undergrad? Uh, I undergraduated from the University of Pune, India. And, uh, uh, and I majored in electronics and telecommunication. Can you tell us your undergraduate GPA? Uh, it was 3.4. I see. And um, like how many, uh, like what was your GMAT profile? Uh, my GMAT score was 660, uh, my TOEFL was 108. So I see, and like how did you shortlist universities like on uh, your own? So, uh, because I uh, knew what I wanted to concentrate in, I shortlisted my uh, universities based on the concentration. So I, since, still, uh, I, since, uh, since I plan to stick to my technical experience, uh, I shortlisted universities based on that. Uh, I applied to schools that had uh, courses in analytics and MIS. So Eller was one of them. I applied to Rutgers. I uh, applied to Maryland, University of Maryland. I applied to Terry, University of Georgia. Uh, I also applied to Kelly, Indiana University. I got through Rutgers. So how many did you apply to total? Uh, five Okay. Programs. And where all did you have admission from? Uh, I had admission from Rutgers. I had uh, admission from Maryland. Uh, College Park. I, yeah, College Park. Uh, I did not get through Kelly. And yeah. Okay. So three of them. I see. Out of five. So, um, uh, did you have funding over here? Yeah. So, uh, I have close to 70% scholarship here. I see. And, yes. So, your GMAT, once again, I, sorry. Uh, my GMAT score was 660. Okay, okay, fine. And All right. Yeah. So, you had 70% funding. I see. 70%. So, and you're doing the dual degree? I'm planning to do the dual degree. I see. Okay. So, um, did the other universities offer you funding? Uh, not the amount that was offered here. Uh, yes. So was that a, like a major factor in your decision? One of the major factors because uh, since I plan to do a dual degree as well, uh, I mean that, that would help me, uh, I, I would say. Okay. So um, um, like on 5 star, how do you rate your experience here? Uh, so far it has been excellent, I would say. Uh, I mean the experience has, uh, it's been overwhelming but it has been fun. And I, uh, it's been just seven weeks, but I've already completed first half of my session. I've, I'm done with four courses and there's a lot. It's just not the program. I mean, otherwise the career management team, the, uh, the MBA team as such, they're very uh, helpful and we've been doing a lot of activities. So I would say four on five. Oh, four on five. Okay. So what could be better? Uh, I think it's, I mean, they don't have a role to play in that. It's just uh, the companies that are skeptical about international students. Yeah. So, so you're saying they don't uh, give as many job offers for right, international right. students I mean, for the visa that, sponsorship. Yeah. yeah. So uh, that has been uh, like a major factor this time. Like, yeah. Some of the MIS students do get jobs, right? Like in yeah, Deloitte. Yeah, because MIS has a STEM extension. Has a what? STEM. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah. So, so but, but you're doing a dual degree, right? So yeah. you don't have to be too worried about that. Yes. Yeah. So, okay. So, um, um, like, um, so do you strongly recommend this program for future students? Uh, of course. I mean, people who want to concentrate in MIS and uh, healthcare as well. I mean, there are a lot of opportunities and the program is really good for healthcare management as well. So, yeah, uh, people who want to concentrate in MIS and they know uh, what they want to do, uh, if they're looking for healthcare and MIS, they should. Okay. So, um, um, I think we got almost all the uh, questions answered and um, so you're going to, this is your first semester here? Right. Okay. I see. So what about your uh, living expenses? You have a teaching assistantship uh, or something? Right. I do have. So I am uh, actually helping the MIS department head. Oh, she uh, she is researching and I am assisting her with her research. Oh, like a research assistantship. Yeah. I see. Yeah. So um, do you live with a roommate? Uh, yeah, I, I have rented an apartment. Uh, yeah, I, we share the apartment. So what is the approximate cost of living here? Uh, well, it depends on how... how no, I mean how much you yeah. pay, for example. Uh, like so to, for to, my, my 
monthly rent is for fifty dollars, and it's a two bed, two bath, or uh, it's a two bed, two bed, one bath. Yeah. Okay. So um, yeah, it's just for idea for future students, right. you know. All right. So uh, and monthly, I would say around. One fifty two hundred on groceries and other sundry expenses. So, I see. Yeah. So um, I think your scholarship pretty much covers all right. your living expenses, yeah. right? Okay. So uh, thank you very much, and wish you thank all the success in the world. Thank you so much.